Hello, this video is about baking the vertex color from a high poly mesh to a low poly mesh. Okay, here we got two flowers. They look um, similar, similar or I think the same, but the difference is when I turn on the wireframe, you see here, um, yeah, it's a very low poly mesh here with a texture. And this is the high poly mesh with the vertex color. Um, here, when I uh, disable the show painting, this is vertex color. And when I disable the texture it's only a picture here this is a this is when you you are at yeah, this is the last point with your object when you finished your work you can bake the textures um, as long as you are sculpting use your vertex colors Okay, and how to do this? I start with a new scene. Yes. Okay, first we need more. Um, I delete this here here at the moment and here here is a setting when you start with your primitive keep primitive UVs and For now, only box sphere, uh, only box and sphere are supported. Um, when you start with a, a primitive, it's sometimes nice when you have a nice UV map at the beginning, like this. Uh, you can use it. Otherwise, you have to unwrap the UV map later. Okay. We have now our sphere and we need uh, more vertices as yeah, 1.5 million is okay. This is it. This is not about creating the flower, <laughs> but I need an example. Um, Okay, we got the texture, the alpha is okay. And the next thing is we need a layer. Symmetry off. Yeah, and I bring in here the, the flower and I extract now the layer and the sphere I don't need anymore. And a little bit the flower needs a little bit more symmetry on. Okay, I think now the flower is fine. Okay, and here is a offset channel. We can adjust it here a little bit more. I 
I think now I'm happy. Okay, we can merge the layer down. And now we have our high res mesh with a vertex painting on it. I showed in the video before uh, with decimation you can use a round all brush and smooth the mesh a little bit one, one brush stroke with a round all brush. Okay. And then now it starts to to bake the mesh. We need um, a clone of the first object and they are overlapping at the moment. They are at the same place and leave them on the same place. And you can use now the solo view at the bottom. There's a solo view option and turn the wireframe on. And you need to decimate your mesh. Here are the settings, preserve painting zero and here uniform faces and decimate your mesh. I think we have now 900 vertices and it's okay. And you see here, when you press UV, this is your UV map at the moment. And here's a setting in the debug. There, Nomad will normalize the UVs inside the zero to one tile and press this then your UV map is normalized and now it's fine and here in the topology here create texture from the mesh texture baking here you can change the settings here, you can bake only the color or the metalness or the roughness and so on. Now all maps are baked and you can change the, rend the resolution of the baking. Uh, now at the moment it's um, about yeah, 1024. You can use here uh, 2000 or 4000, okay and I leave it in this setting. I hide the UV map now and now I press from high res sphere baking and now you get this and here when you change the resolution I can go a step back when I type in here 500 and press here and it looks also okay for such, such a, a small flower. Yeah, I leave it. And that's it. The, you baked your mesh and You see here, this is a high poly version and this is a low poly version. And here are some, yeah, from the decimation, I think um, but it looks real nice. And I I go a few steps back here
here at this point I think the decimation yeah it creates such yeah, fields here but I don't know why Now the UV is normalized and I change here the, the, the baking resolution to uh, 1024 and I bake it again and because Um, here's a normal map here you when you change here the normal map um, it works better I think with a resolution of 1024 and with this the things here you can choose uh, the trim tool and sorry I delete this layer we don't need it you can hear uh, oops not this with a lasso tool I think you can delete such things here but to look better I think we got symmetry on. Turn off symmetry. Yeah. Okay. That's it. Have fun with sculpting. Ciao.